I'm just, I am sleeping in my clothes because as Christina says, um, from Watercolor Me Press, um, that is a great way to save time in the mornings when you have to get up early for a doctor appointment and don't want to wake up early. <laughs> and to save spoons on that, what I'm doing is today, on Sunday, I'm making chicken nuggets and tomorrow, Monday, I am making these fried Korean potato slices that everybody likes. I have quite the hairdo today. It's my gaming hairdo because whenever a situation on a game gets tight and I get start getting anxious, I just mess with my hair like this and it sticks up on end. <laughs> but um, today I have to make a bunch of chicken nuggets, which takes forever because we don't have a commercial kitchen. So I have to cook, and I can't cook them in the stove. I can't cook them in a fryer, so I have to cook them in a skillet on the stove. And so it takes forever because I have to make a bunch for everybody. And <laughs> Homemade, so I have to coat them, chop the chicken, coat them, cook them all the way through, and it takes a long time. But I have to do it that way because that's the way everyone can eat it because of um, either Caroline's gastroparesis having trouble swallowing it. She can't, she can't eat them if I cook them in the oven, but she can if I cook them on the stove because the texture is different. And then uh, I just have to make them ingredient safe for everybody, and yeah, it takes a lot of work and it wears me out, but it's worth it because people can eat it. So. Right now, I'm saving my spoons for that because I need to do that because Tuesday we have to go on the road to Jackson and we need to take the chicken nuggets with us so we have food on the road. <laughs> but uh, I have really have to work on saving my energy for that though because storms are coming back today. We had a few sunny days and now it's another stormy day and it's taking a toll on my health, especially on my dysonomia and my lungs. My lungs hurt a lot more and they feel a lot heavier and I'm having a harder time breathing. So that sucks. I really hope that it, at least, even if it doesn't improve through it throughout the day, I hope it doesn't get worse. Because if it gets worse, it's going to be really hard to get my work done. So for now, lately, I've, I mean, so far this morning, I've mostly just um, watched, played Overwatch and edited and posted the vlog. And I'm about to rest. Might take a nap. I haven't decided yet. But even if I don't take a nap, I'll just lay here and quietly watch TV because I'm one out with this storm coming through, but it's a pretty good day. I'm, my depression's not as bad today so far, so I'm thankful for that. And I took a Toradol and that is helping with my pain level, so I'm also thankful for that. But, uh, I'll see y'all in a bit. Hey guys, I am preparing for Tuesday's trip to Jackson. And to save spoons on that, what I'm doing is today, on Sunday I'm making chicken nuggets, and tomorrow, Monday, I am making these fried Korean potato slices that everybody likes. Doing them all in one day would be too much on my health, especially right now, because this weather is bothering me. A storm system's rolling in and it's like really making me flare. My chest hurts a lot more, my lungs are tighter. Um, I'm having lots of heart palpitations, I'm shaky, I'm feverish. So I can't do them all in one day, it takes too much work. But yeah. So, I have to do them all on the stove, but I do two pans at once to help save some time. But it still takes a while, and I get really hot. I mean, I'm already hot, and I don't even have the stove on, so I'm not looking forward to the heat. Um, but I'll show you all my working space. Okay, so here, I can cut up the chicken. I'm going to give Hannah this chicken. It's her special, special organic chicken with no hormones. We have regular chicken. <laughs> um, I'll cut it up, then I will dredge it in tapioca with onion and garlic powder and salt and then in some egg that also has seasonings in it and then on the stove i'll add some um, light olive oil to these pans and over medium-ish heat i will cook them but yeah
I after doing the chicken nuggets, I was so when I got I was in a lot of pain, not feeling good. Um, but I the time I got in bed, I crashed. I couldn't keep my eyes open. I could barely move my arms, and so I was laid here with my eyes closed, listening to vlogs on YouTube. But thankfully, I recovered eventually, and I was able to play some Overwatch. But I'm really frustrated with that because. I'm in a losing streak, and I don't know why I can win in quick play and 6v6 mystery heroes, but every time I do competitive mode, I've lost. <laughs> and so, last, when I did my placement matches for the previous season a couple weeks ago, because I didn't start the, last se the previous season until near the end, I placed in gold, but now I'm placed in bronze, and I'm just so frustrated. I can't win, and I don't, ah, oh, it's frustrating. And so, I don't know, I'll just practice when I get, as I get chances and try to get a winning streak so I can get my SR level up. But, ah, that was frustrating. I just kept losing. But I did meet some people who we communicate with even well with, even if we weren't winning. And they like anime, so we kept talking about anime, so that was fun. <laughs> but, oh, I was so frustrated with losing. I was like so motivated to improve and win. <laughs> oh, I felt so much better about my skill level yesterday. <laughs> and I don't, I just, ah. It's like, no matter what I did, we lost. And it's just like, okay, I'll try not being the healer, but someone has to be a healer. <laughs> and, ah. <sighs> it's frustrating, guys. Ah. <laughs> but I'm happy the chicken nuggets came out well. They taste really good. I accidentally added too much garlic for Mama. Ah. Oh well. Um, she can manage them. It's just too much. But it's because I accidentally added in more than I meant to. It came out quicker than I meant to. But oh well. I'm exhausted. So I'm gonna go to bed. I can wake up early. I'd like to wake up again early tomorrow, so I don't want to get to bed too late tonight. But thank you for watching us and joining us on our day. Tomorrow I'm going to be making some fried Korean potato slices. So come back tomorrow if you want to see that. <laughs> Good night. Good morning, guys. It is Monday, which I keep feeling like it's Sunday, and so it's really confusing me. But because it's Monday, it's Hannah's birthday. So happy birthday, Hannah. I kept forgetting to tell her because I kept thinking the day was wrong. <laughs> But, yeah, tomorrow's Tuesday when we go to the doctor appointment in Mississippi. So we can't celebrate her birthday today. We're having put it off till the weekend, I believe. So, same with Caroline's birthday, who is the day after tomorrow. So we're putting both their birthdays off till the weekend because um, my game's starting, so I have to go. So, yeah, I was in a skirmish while filming, and then a comp uh, competitive game started, and so I had to go right away. But I'm really happy because last night, as I said, I was having a losing streak. And because of that losing streak, I placed in bronze, even though two weeks ago I placed in gold in, for the eighth season. And now we're in the ninth season of competitive mode on Overwatch. So, but I'm almost in silver. So, because I, find, I broke my losing streak today, started out playing some quick games with one of the guys I played with last night. We um, were doing really well, so we decided to go into a competitive mode. And we've won nine games, and I'm so happy. So I am over that losing streak, and I feel so much better. But that was really nice. This last one went like really quickly, so that was a good game. And I am now level 71. So I am very happy. But yeah, I have to get stuff done in the kitchen. I do not feel good. The weather here is stormy today, and after doing so much in the kitchen yesterday, I'm just not feeling good. I keep feeling like my muscles are shaking, and my heart rate's all over the place, and I feel weak and fatigued, and my pain is high, and my lungs are bad, and I don't want to do anything. I just want to be able to rest in bed. But we have to go to Mississippi tomorrow, so I have to cook instead. I made the chicken nuggets last night, so today I have to make fried curry and potato slices and some homemade bread. So Hannah's gonna help me with the potato slices, and... Yeah, I'm just going to try to do it as quickly as I can and then rest. I'm not going to be feeling good, but yeah. And then after I recover from doing work in the kitchen, I have to take my bath and wash my hair and stuff. So it's not going to be a fun night, but I have to do it. And I don't feel good. But it'll help that Hannah's helping me. And it's her birthday, so it'll be nice to spend time with her. But 
yeah I feel like I'm shaking it's weird feeling it's like I feel like a little vibrating it's annoying but I'm gonna go get my work done and I will see y'all in a bit so I'm done with the potatoes and the bread and I don't like to complain guys but I feel so miserable and I just don't want to go tomorrow I just want to stay home and sleep I actually want to go sleep now but I can't because I have to take a break then I have to take a bath, I have to get my clothes, I have to make my medicine list, and I have to make sure I have everything ready to go out the door in the morning. And we have to leave at 8.15, it's now like 10.15 p.m., so I, I'll definitely sleep on the road tomorrow, though. I'll sleep a lot on the road. But I don't feel good, and I just... My whole body's so weak, I'm so fatigued. My breathing, if you just, if I just, not talk you, if I, you can, if you just listen to my breathing, it sounds like shallow, kind of like hollow, not quite wheezing, but like, it sounds like my airways are tight and not and constricted partially, which they are because I have pleurisy, <laughs> but I just feel bad, and I did what I had to do, but I feel bad, <laughs> so I'm gonna try to keep myself awake, but take a break. So I can get more work done in a bit. I can take more blood pressure medicine, my midogene, in 15 minutes. So I'll take that, let that kick in, and then finish my other work and then go to bed for the night. I'll see y'all in a bit. So I have all my stuff ready for tomorrow. I'm just, I am sleeping in my clothes because as Christina says, um, from Watercolor Me Press, um, that is a great way to save time in the mornings when you have to get up early for a doctor appointment and don't want to wake up early. <laughs> But, yeah, let me show y'all what I'm wearing. Um, new outfit, actually. New shirt from Goodwill. And a pair of pink jeggings from Walmart. Super comfortable. Oh, yeah, let's turn the light off. Super comfortable. And so it'll be good for the road. And that's pretty much it. It won't wrinkle. I can sleep in it, so it's nice. Uh, it's late. It's almost 1 a.m. And we have to get up early. We have to be on the road out by 8 15 so I don't get much sleep but I can up on the way and I'm sure I will because I am beyond exhausted guys I did not want to do anything today I was like in a really oh the whole time I was eating the potatoes and even afterwards I was just like in such a stressed out mood not wanting to go tomorrow not feeling like I could do anything I just don't feel well guys I'm worn out this is more than I've done in months since Thanksgiving and I just don't, I'm one out. And I'm still not that healthy. The prednisone's helping me, but I'm still half pleurisy. I still, I'm, my eyes was still flaring. Everything's still flaring. The weather today didn't help. <laughs> but, <coughs> but after I finished cooking the Korean potatoes, I um, had to rest for a bit before I could take a bath and get dressed and stuff. And let some more blood pressure medicine kick in. So I played some Overwatch to help with stress and to keep myself awake but rested. And it actually helped. It got rid of my stress. And I feel so much better now. It's good just chatting with my friend on there. And to, um, it was good chatting with them. And just to play. It's a really good de-stressor. And so I had fun. Um, we lost two matches because terrible teamwork. The teams were just, our team was just doing whatever, they, uh, it was so bad composition guys, and they wouldn't listen or do anything. But the third match, I, um, our team, we were all like, we were all communicating, we were working together, we were working on team composition, and we won very well, easily. And so, that was nice. It was a good um, game to leave off on, because it made me happy to win before logging off. But, uh, yeah, I am one out. Mama is currently taking a bath. Caroline's seen, it's ready for tomorrow. She just has to wash her hair in the morning, so she'll probably be going to bed soon. Hannah's probably not going to sleep tonight, she said. So, here. Sarah's not asleep, so. Yeah. Dad had another um, jujitsu night tonight, so he enjoyed that, and he's one out. But I think it's good for him. Hopefully, he won't get any injuries while doing it. Because uh, it's common to get injuries with it, uh, he said. But I hope you'll be okay. He enjoys it, so that's good. But, yeah, tomorrow's going to be a long day. So I didn't edit a vlog today. I was just not at all motivated with everything going on. And 
Yeah. Maybe I'll, I'll be able to edit on the road. I don't know. We'll see. Um, if I can't, I'll just catch up. I definitely can't upload tomorrow because we won't have Wi-Fi, but even if, if I can't, I'll just catch up the next day. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to get some sleep. So thank you guys for watching. So please join us tomorrow for our road trip and to see how the doctor appointment goes. But good night and I'll see you then. Bye.